Back to that breaking news we told you about at the top of the show. A deadly house fire in Shelby. The fire killed an eight year old and left a five year old severely burned. The fire broke out a home in the 300 block of Lineberger Street just before 1130 last night. NBC Charlotte's Kendall Morris is in Shelby for us and Kendall do officials know what caused this fire? The cause of the fire is still under investigation, but officials tell me that signs are pointing to it being accidental. The house is still standing here, but you can see just how much damage that fire Fire did. This house in Shelby bears the burns. You couldn't even see the house. It was just pitch black. From the smoke and flames that engulfed it less than 24 hours ago. Officials say the call for the fire came in just before 1130 p.m. A neighbor tells us the mother who lives in the house and her oldest son were moving an old couch to the neighbor's home across the street. That's when the neighbor says the fire broke out with two young boys still inside. I heard some screaming and yelling. I came out on the front porch and I realized that my neighbor's house was on fire and I heard the mother say that one of her babies was inside. Officials say a neighbor rescued a five year old boy, an eight year old left in the home. I ran down to the house and she showed me, told me where the window was that um, he was at and I ran to that window and they were just, it was so engulfed in flames, it was, it was already too late. Neighbors shared these pictures of the family with us. Officials say the five-year-old, who neighbors identify as Rodriguez Moore, was taken to Atrium in Shelby and then transported to the burn unit in Winston-Salem with severe burns. Neighbors tell us eight-year-old Jalen Payne did not survive. It was a bad feeling and uh, realizing that, you know, you couldn't, it was a person inside the house and you wasn't you wasn't gonna be able to help them. Friends have already started a fund online to help this family out. There's also a vigil being planned for this Saturday. Reporting in Shelby, Kendall Morris, NBC Charlotte.